Hey guys, it's Julia. So, um, I don't know if you can tell, but I'm pretty sure you can. Um, I'm actually filming with a new camera. So yeah, I finally got it. Um, got it at Best Buy for like a super, super good deal. Um, I'll show this to you in the mirror right now. This is it. It is a Canon S150, uh, and I think IS or SI or whatever. But, um, they've got this deal going on at Best Buy right now. This camera was originally $250, and I got it for... There's something on my mirror that's not the camera. Ugh. Gotta fix that for you. Now it just looks worse, I'm gonna move over. <laughs> but, uh... Yeah, now, you know what? My mirror is disgusting. I'm sorry, guys. That was really gross. Um... <laughs> I promise none of it is, like fecal matter or anything. It's all like hair products. Um, but yeah, the camera is originally like uh, $250 and it's actually on sale for $150 right now. And um, it also comes with a bundle which is like a mini tripod, a SD card, and a carrying bag. Um, and those are like half off. I don't know what exactly it is, but they're, they're, if you buy the camera, you get a really good deal on them. And, um, so my total came out to be like $184 for all of it, except I didn't get the tripod because they were out of the tripod, and I was like, it's whatever, I'll probably, I'd probably buy a different one anyway because it was seriously like six inches tall. Um, but I still haven't gotten the tripod because at that point when I went and bought all this, um, I only had like $200 and the rest was in ones and I didn't feel like spending like every penny I had on me at that point. Um, but I did get paid today uh, from the coffee house and um, yeah, hopefully I'll get the hell out of here to buy that soon. Um, the only problem I really have with this camera is I can't see myself at all. So if I'm like at a terrible angle, like I'm so sorry, but I'm just getting used to this. And um, <laughs> yeah, I can't, I can't see the screen like I usually would on my webcam. Um, but anyway... Besides getting a new camera, I've been getting all kinds of packages in the mail lately. Yesterday, I got my new set of gauges. They are fours. Um, and funny story about this, like, I get all my gauges on eBay from the same guy, and shipping takes forever, and blah blah blah. I got two packages from him yesterday. And they both had the same thing. Like, check this out. I got these, and then I got these. They're the same exact thing. And so I messaged this guy, because I was worried. Because um, I'd also ordered, like, the day after I got these, I ordered um, some green plugs in a size up, and then some ivory-looking cool... Um, acrylic, like, faux tooth, <laughs> um, gauges in the size above that. And, um, I thought maybe he screwed up the order and accidentally sent me two instead of sending me those. And, uh, it turns out that's what happened. But, um, yeah, I've got these extra set of gauges. But, um, yesterday I posted on Tumblr, I was like, does anyone want these? And, uh, someone claimed them. So, unstillbeast.tumblr.com, um, I'll be sending these out, like, ASAP. Um, I don't know, probably, like, tomorrow. Um, but I told you I'd message you, so, yeah. So, um, I get home from work today, and I check my phone, because, like, I don't, 
I get like no reception down where I work. Um, so I always check my phone when I get home. And Jacob, my boyfriend, sends me a text message and it's like, Hey, when you're out of work, um, come to my house because I have a present for you. And um, I don't know if I told you this before, but he never got me a birthday present, so he's owed me for a while now. And um, I get there, and he comes out of his house with this. Okay? Here, let me do this a different way. Oh, ho, ho, ho. This. Alright, ignore everything else that's around it, because I'll talk about that later. And, um... Oh, I'm sorry guys. I'm so sorry. The camera angles are going crazy. But um he comes out and you one of these broke open. That's what was that was smelling so good. Oh, you saw it. Shh. Nothing happened. Um But he comes out and he's like, so I went to the store and it turns out what I was looking to get you was discontinued and therefore on clearance. So, I just got you a bunch of them. <laughs> and he gets me um, three bottles of Forever Sunshine, which is my favorite um, scent from Bath & Body Works. And then he also got me Forever Sunshine Body Lotion. So, and it's triple moisture. Ooh, yes, perfect, because I'm so crusty. But, um... Initially, I was absolutely heartbroken because they're discontinuing my favorite scent. Like, you have no idea. Like, I love this shit. Psst, oh, my God. It's like heaven. You know, it's like sunflowers and goodness. And, um... And then I was like, oh, he's so sweet. He's like, well, you've had that bottle for a long time. Like, it's it's taken you like a year to use it up, right? And to be honest, it's actually taken me more than a year to use it up because I have other sprays and I kind of go through them and whatnot and he goes well here's three years worth of forever sunshine body spray so I'm set for a very very long time which makes me happy and he's wonderful so thank you Jacob I love you so much so then I get home and I'm sitting around and uh Dad comes in with the mail and he goes, Juji B, you got some packages. And um so I go downstairs and I actually have three packages. I'm like, whoa, got the jackpot today. Um the first one was actually from PETA. And um I have like a ton of these extra like points. Um, that you get from PETA 2, um, from back when I was really big into activism, and I have been waiting for something really awesome to come up on the goods to exchange them for, but I figured I might as well just go ahead and get the lip balms, because I love lip balms. They're like my favorite. Um, so I got these. They are, where are you? We have Animals Out of the Act Tangerine, Viva Las Vegans, which is vanilla bean, and Cut Out Animal Experiments Peppermint. And when I first checked it out, I was like, what on earth did I get that was this big? Because I really haven't ordered anything other than shoes that have been this big, and the shoes shouldn't be here for like another two or three days. Um, but yeah, they sent me these three lip balms, like that's all that was in there, in this giant envelope. Like, for size, this is my hand, this is the envelope. And, <laughs> you know, whatever. So then I also had um, two envelopes. Yeah, sorry, my batteries drain so fast. Um, two envelopes from the guy I buy my gauges from. And one of them had my Lebrays. They're cool, they have like a um, little blue rhinestone in them. And honestly, like, I don't even know what I'm going to use these for. I got them because I thought I was going to pierce my nose, but I just pierced my septum. And I don't know if I'm ready to pierce my nose just yet, so I might keep these. I also didn't know I was getting a pair, so that's cool. Um... 
I don't think I'm going to do snake bites or any lip piercings because, eh, I don't know. They're cool, but they're just not for me. Um, I would look good with snake bites, but I don't think I want them. And I also got these plugs. They are zeros, and they're like glittery and wonderful. And um, I'm not going to be able to wear these for a long time because I'm communicating my problem with the guy right now. And I just asked him to send what I originally ordered. Um, and it usually takes like two weeks to get my stuff so maybe he'll be nice and get me like super fast shipping but i don't know if he's gonna do that yeah i meant to talk to you about my septum um i don't know if you guys have watched the past couple videos or have been staying updated with my life but i did pierce my septum by myself i don't know if i ever told you that i was planning on doing that but i did it um two days ago and it's healing really well I clean it with um, a salt water solution that I made and I looked it up online and they said definitely use sea salt which is good because that's like the only salt we have in my house because my mom uh, you know she likes to buy fancy stuff and I also um, put some antibacterial stuff in it so I've been spraying that on and you know rinsing it washing it with like hand soaps and stuff and um, sometimes boogers get stuck on it and it gets kind of pussy, um, but that's good. It's all part of the healing process. And um, it's done scabbing. It's all it's all pus right now, so that's always good. And um, so yeah, and it hurts a little less every day. It's still sore. When I wake up, it's swollen and gross. And the ring is... A bit too small for me, for me so I ordered a, a different one but I'm not gonna be able to put it in until this heals um, so that's my update on that and um, I think that's just about everything so thanks for watching my videos guys thanks for all your support and everything um, you guys are so great like you don't even know and I love talking to all of you so feel free to talk to me um, if you aren't already, I definitely want you to subscribe. Go ahead, do it. You know, it won't be awkward. Like, I don't know if you think it would be, because that's just weird. Um, but yeah, that's all I really got to say. So I'll see you later, guys.